welcome to today's video. Today's video is a highly requested video where you guys have asked me about little ingredients from our kitchens that have come in really handy for me over a period of time that have worked really well for my skin brightening, exfoliating, smoothing, that sort of a thing. Now that so many of us are home at the moment, I thought this would be a great time to share this with you. This is a mask that I've used plenty of times and today I'm going to tell you how you can make the same mask at home in like hardly two to three minutes and see the difference on your skin over 20 minutes. Let's not make this intro any longer. Let me go take my makeup off and then we should dive right into this. Okay, I'm back. I have taken my makeup off. I have slipped into a robe and we're about to dive into the face mask. Now, the only ingredients you need, I'm using only four ingredients for today's face mask, is a little bit of tomato paste, turmeric, about two or three tablespoons of milk and some honey. If you have raw honey, absolutely amazing. Please use raw organic honey. The properties that these ingredients have are really rich in exfoliating, in smoothening your skin, uh, in working on uneven skin tone. Tomatoes are great in that. These are great products for detoxifying. In fact, so many people even drink turmeric water and not just apply it. I've tried it once, it did not taste great, but I mean to give it another go at some point. Uh, and of course, milk. With milk, I'm gonna give you two other options as well. You can swap this ingredient with either uh, malai or yogurt, depending on your preference but of course if you have allergies to dairy or are lactose intolerant in any form please replace this with like an almond milk or a soy milk or something of that sort now all we're gonna do is take my other ingredients that I have over here the tomato turmeric and honey and mix it up with the bowl of uh, milk I have over here there's only two to three tablespoons you will basically get a nice paste dish to liquidy form um, of, of the face mask that you're making and then you can go ahead and mix it up and leave it as thick or thin as you like okay I've got my little concoction over here it's fairly liquidy um, I feel like I could have added a little more tomato paste in this for sure but what I'm gonna do is just take the brush that I'm already using to mix it up and I'm gonna start applying it on my face. If you feel like you've made a little excess, because I definitely feel like I have made a little bit of an excess, uh, you can go ahead and put this in a little tin, in a little box and store it in your fridge. Don't worry about any wastage with this one. something that will not bother you um, while it's on your skin because you are going to leave it on for about 20 minutes so it's not something that will bother you it's not heavy on the skin it won't fall off as you can see it's very like water like all you're seeing is a sheer layer of like yellow coming from the turmeric so it's really cool for you to like wear at home and continue with your usual tasks um, without worrying about it <music> The fragrance of this, by the way, is also really nice. A face mask like this, by the way, goes really well with all skin types. Uh, the honey looks after the dryness, the tomato looks after the uh, pigmentation and also the detoxifying. The turmeric is a really, really strong uh, detoxifier again. Dairy works really well for the exfoliation. So it doesn't matter what your skin type is, you can 100% go ahead and use this. In fact, there are very rare things I say this for. Even if you have sensitive skin, I don't think this should be a problem because they're all 100% natural ingredients. Only probably be careful of the honey. Uh, make sure it is completely raw and organic if you have very sensitive skin. Okay, so I think I'm done with applying this. I've applied a nice layer all over my face. Uh, we're going to give this 20 minutes, wait for it to dry out and then I'm going to come back to you which for you will be just a second. Alright, so there you go. You can see my face pack has been washed off with some warm water. You can do this with a damp napkin if you prefer. My skin instantly feels better. It feels awake. I don't know if like you understand what I'm saying, but like it feels awake. It definitely feels a whole lot smoother. Um, and if you do this consistently two to three times a week, I feel like this is something that you'll 
over a period of time really see the difference between all of these ingredients are available in your kitchen right there you don't need to go and buy anything new anything special right now we're all at home so i really hope you guys will go ahead and try this out it literally takes no time you guys so you just have to mix up all of the ingredients and if you do go ahead and try it please let me know your thoughts about it down below in the comments if you've enjoyed this video hit like and Subscribe with alerts on so you get the alerts for all of my upcoming videos because I'm being like super regular and doing like this everyday sort of a thing over here to keep you guys entertained. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. See you in the next one.